Okay, it's Tuesday, that means it's Ask Kathy Day. The question that came to me this week has come to me for five years from everybody, from busy professionals who own their own business, small business owners, big business owners, and even busy professionals who work for large organizations. They wanna know, how do I hire outside help? How do I hire experts? Why do I need to hire outside help and experts? And then it's more of a tell Kathy instead of an ask Kathy, I can't afford the experts. I can't afford it. How do I afford it? Well, I'm about to tell you that Seth Godin just the other day wrote an unbelievable, he always writes a blog and he's always a genius, but he said there's a transformative moment when you look at an expert as someone who's not doing something that you could do for free. Instead, you look at an expert as cheap because it frees you up to do something that you're good at, better than the expert at. I've been saying for years and years, and some entrepreneurs have been listening to me and some haven't, and the ones who listened to me and did it were transformative in their business. Once you say, I need to hire out what I'm not good at, even though I can do Quicken and I can do the books, I am not contributing to my business's bottom line. I am doing this for my business. This is what I do. This is my core strength. That's what you should be spending 80% of your time doing. You should hire out people who are faster and quicker and better than you at everything else. Let me tell you a big example of when I have a client who has a $5 million company. She doesn't want to pay a recruiter the six or $7,000 it's going to take to find a fantastic employee to fill a spot. Yet that person is going to bring in about $80,000 in revenue over the course of the next year. So she's worried about $7,000, which is a lot of money. I'm not saying it's not a lot of money. But that person doesn't get paid their salary the day they come in. They get paid over the course of the life of the year. And they are going to bring her in net profit $80,000. Out of the first year's profits from that employee, you take the $7,000 yeah, that you need to pay the recruiter. Those are the kind of things that I'm telling you, your time and your energy are worth a lot of money to your company. When you're a busy professional and you want to think about hiring people out, think about people to clean your house. Think about people to mow your lawn. Think about people to take your kids to and from. Think about having a nanny. Thinking, think, about, think outside of the box. What is your time worth? What is your time worth? If you are a working couple, it is one of the, and with no judgment, one of the biggest costs that people debate over is nanny versus child care and driving to a daycare situation. You have to sit down and decide whether that's important for you and your career, and that's okay for you and your husband to say, we want to be able to focus on our careers and spend every minute with our kids that we can and not have it be in the car driving. And it might cost you more in the first couple of years, but guess what? You're home faster. You, your nanny may be able to grocery shop, do your dry cleaning. You don't clean the house. You don't know that. Those are things that you need to do. think about when you're hiring experts at home and in your business life as if you are an entrepreneur. You can afford it. You can't not afford to be spending the time on doing what you do really well 80% of the time because that's what you started your company for. That's what your organization hired you to do. So if you want to fill your cup and you want to be doing something that you're good at and feels great and doesn't feel like work, then you hire everything else out and it pays for itself. I guarantee you. And when you have that aha moment that it's not someone replacing you, and you're giving away money because you could do it for free. It's more an investment and an expert is the best thing and the most wise decision you can make for your business and your personal life. That's why you hire experts. That's your back pocket strategy for the week. Make it a great week.